So I thought I'd uh, show off this little voltmeter here, uh, uh, multimeter. Um, this is the multimeter I throw in my pocket when I go to the junk store. So let me show you why. And um, I haven't really seen, I don't know if I've actually seen a review of this on, on, uh, on YouTube or not. Maybe there is one, but I don't remember seeing it. Um, it comes in this cool little plastic case that's hinged. And so it hinges open. In fact, it hinges all the way, all the way underneath, which is kind of nice. Um, and then it's got, uh, it's got probes. Now, uh, the thing that I like about it is the case, because I can put the probes in the case and close the lid, and then I don't have these poking, poking me in the, in the side if I put them in my uh, sweatshirt or something. So um, the, there is a downside, uh, although mm, for the type of use that I have, there's not, there's not much, but that is that, uh, they are hardwired into the, uh, let me pull this out. They are hardwired into the, uh, into the unit. So you can't, you can't remove this and put other probes on. So it is what it is. Um, but it is tiny. Uh, let's take a look here. Uh, it's, uh, about 60 by 110 by 10. So it's pretty, it's pretty small. Uh, so turn on, you just, you just rotate this little wheel here. So it's very, 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 very flat. So you rotate it to, um, volts, uh, and, uh, let's see, it'll do AC DC, uh, by selecting. So that's AC, that's DC. Uh, it does ohms. Um, it does, let's see. It does diode checks and it does uh, beeping continuity. Not very good, very scratchy. So it's not latching. Um, and it does uh, capacitance, which is cool. Sometimes when I go in the junk store, I want to measure. I'm not really sure if the capacitance is the right as it's marked on the box or not. So I'll measure them. Uh, it's got a little, um, frequency counter built in. I'm not sure how far it goes up. It'll do microamps and milliamps. So that's pretty cool. Um, I don't really have any use for those at the junk store, but uh, they are in there. So let's see how well this thing works. Um, let's see. I'll bring out my, my poor man's uh, cow board here. Uh, these are, um, let's see. Yeah, these are 0.01%, uh, so one one hundredth of a percent. So these are the these are the resistors. Let me see. Let me swap these, and I can put my put my fat fingers on them. I'm just going to hold this sideways so I can do this and be off camera. So this is uh, let's see, this is ten ohms. So 10.0, this is hundred ohms. You can see that it's a bit slow in calculating, calculating resistance, but there you go. hundred point zero. Uh, this is one K one K. This is 10 K 10.00 hundred K 99.0. Ninety-nine point nine, and this is a meg. So there you go. Uh, wait a minute, is that ten megs? Oh yeah, this is ten megs. I don't have a one meg. Yeah, ten point zero zero. Very very good. So it's very accurate for resistance. Uh, let's put it on volts. Um, I have a very accurate 10 volt reference on this board. So we'll put in 12 and hopefully get out 10. Okay. So we should have 10 available on this little connector here. So we're on volts now. So we'll go between here and here. Uh, I'm not making good, I'm not making good contact. Oh, I'm short. I was shorting out the 12 volts supply. That's what I was doing. So 10.02, close enough for me. Um, so it's a uh, 0.02 off, but not bad. Um, so 
could test milliamps, I guess, if we wanted to. But you know, these things are pretty accurate. These little uh, these little cheapy meters are actually getting pretty accurate these days. So they can be cheap and not so bad. So I thought you'd like this. It's a nice big display. It's very very easy to read. Uh, the characters are about uh, 15 millimeters tall, so it's 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 quite nice. Uh, there's a hold function, a relative, so we can hold it. Uh, there's a relative function if you want to zero it out, so you can like put it on, put it on ohms and and zero it. Well, it's already zero, so <laughs> you don't need to hit the relative, but it'll do relative. And um, yeah, it's pretty cool. It's not backlit, I don't believe. Uh, and this is the uh, part number is UT120C. Uh, so UT120C, the Unity. Uh, what does this read here? 400 milliamps max fused, CAT2 600 volts. Yeah, I'm not sure about that, but <laughs> um, it's cute. And uh, it goes in my pocket, like I said, when I go to the store. It goes in this little case and never, never comes out. And uh, the little, there's like little, uh, little things here to wrap the, to wrap the cord around. And you can, you can do this, which is kind of cool. There's a, uh, there's cutouts on the top and the, top and the bottom. You can just bring them out this way or out this way. And so you can actually have the leads come out and have this thing in here. And there's actually a clear window here. So you actually, you can read the meter. You have to turn, open it up to turn it on, but then you can read the meter through the, through the window here and not even have to take it out of its little, out of its little case. So yeah, it's pretty cool.